Cousin, I have bought the present. You bought it or I did? Rico, I'm offended. I've got us an apartment in Algonquin. What did I say when you got here? Penthouse. Model on each arm. And you have paid for this place? It wasn't so long ago that your debts got you kidnapped by the Russian mob. That was a cold spree. Now I'm hot, cousin. Hotter than the model will be bedding. I can't lose! Roman, we have spoken about your gambling. Wait until you see the new place in me. You'll change your song. So what I took on a little dance? about you running with Patrick McCreary now these days. He's got work and he's a good guy. You're not planning on taking him down, are you? Lay off him, for me. I'm not planning on taking him down. He's my damn brother, you idiot. Packy McCreary, Francis McCreary. It's all starting to make sense. I knew Irish families were big, but I didn't expect to run into brothers in the place the size of Liberty City. Yeah, just thank the Lord you ran into Packy and not my other brothers. Packy's just a hood, but Gerald is into some serious shit. And Derek, he's the worst. If that asshole ever comes back from Ireland, I can't be held responsible for what I do. My brothers ain't no good, Nico. Trust me on that. You know what? Me and Packy get along. Maybe if doing what you do is good, then I want to be no good instead. I should meet the other McCreary's. Be careful what you wish for. This is why I push it to the limit all the time! So the plan was they were gonna hide the diamonds in the Queen's ass. Can you get us a car, man? I'm afraid these two idiots can't drive for shit. Fuck you, Packy. Yeah, fuck you.
us out to the waste management plant under the Algonquin Bridge on Colony Island, big man. Calculating route. Turn left. A mafia-controlled waste management plant? You fucking guessed it. It's an Ancelotti operation. Ray tipped us off about a big payoff they just got. A fat cash payoff. Ancelotti's, huh? I can't tell all those Watt families apart. Ancelotti's, Gambinos, Pecorinos. It's the fucking Pegarinos, man. We're working for them. Pecorinos are a type of cheese. Pegorinos is a bunch of Guido gangsters out of Alderney. They're all mafia, though? Of course they are. Cosa Nostra and all that shit. Our family used to be bigger than all them mafia families put together. Back in the day, that is. Not this shit again. I heard this speech a million times. The McCreary's ran the city. People were scared to say their name, let alone come near their place in purgatory. Life was great. We were in charge. It's fucking true. I'd like to hear you tell Gerald that it's a boring story. My brother wouldn't take too kindly to that now, would he? You know the purgatory is called what it is because people were so scared of the McCreary's? Did you know that, Nico? It's called that because people found the McCreary story so fucking boring. Listening to them was like being in purgatory. Fuck you, Gordon. I'll fucking come back there and kick your fucking ass in a minute. I hear that Francis McCreary is your brother. Fucking Frankie, my brother. He may have a badge, but I tell you for a fact, he's as crooked as the rest of us McCreary's. More so. At least we ain't fucking hypocrites. Kate's the only decent one. I can believe that. You know Frankie, do you? I got a story for you if you do. Another fucking story. Shut up, Gordon. So, Nico. When Francis and Gerald was growing up, Frankie becomes an altar boy. He swears to this day that he wanted to serve the Lord. Jerry knows the truth, though. He only put on that cassock so he could pocket the change in the collection plate. Fact. That's Francis, down to a fucking T. I don't even know if he realizes what a crook he is. That sounds like the Francis McCreary I met. I bet. Model community leader in my ass. You're just worried he'll start clamping down on you. Ain't you, Paggy? I'd like to see him try it. Not gonna happen with the things Jerry knows. Driving in Liberty fucking city, eh? If Ray is correct, then the money's going to be kept in the office in the main building. And Don't go too fucking far, Nico.
Johnny, cover me, will you? He's fucking bought it. What am I gonna tell his brother? Shit! Can you get us a car, man? I'm afraid these two idiots can't drive for shit. Fuck you, Packy. Yeah, fuck you. Ah! 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 Calculating route. This is Come on! Fun. You have arrived. <laughs> Take us out to the waste management plant under the Algonquin Bridge on Colony Island, big man. Calculating route. In 200 yards. Turn Becky, right. you hang out in some strange places. First you take me to a fish market and now a waste plant? It looks like you ain't too pleased with the date you've been taking them on, Patrick. You gotta learn how to treat a man right. Shut it, Gordo. Ray's giving us a tip-off about a big payment the Ancelotti's just got. We're all gonna do real well out of this. These places are messed up. I think this Ray guy's fucking with you. No one's fucking with me, Nico. This is how things work here. The whole city's turned into a fucking theme park. Only places an honest criminal can make any money are these shitholes. I think they're fucking with you, Packy. They're laughing at you. You think they're having a laugh with Gerald, Gordo? You think even these Alderney Guidos would have the balls to do that? Them Guidos use you for what they like. If the peg asked Gerald to wipe his ass, he probably would. What's that say about you then, Gordo, if you're taking orders from Packy? That don't mean shit. Fucking with us or not, these jobs pay the bills, don't they? The only thing they're doing for Gordon is keeping the bookies off his back for another week. How much you lose on that swingers game last week? That shit was rigged. I got screwed in the ninth damn inning. A guy who bats 150 hits a three-run homer. Bullshit. Don't go dropping too much green after this. If the Ancelotti's here, we've been spending it up, they might finger us for this job. If that happens, the bookies will be the least of your words. Don't trouble yourself about me, Packy. I'm sitting on my money. How can I throw it all the bookies like Gordon over here? I'm saving it up, so... I don't give a shit what you're doing with your cut. All I care about is you holding up your end on the job. You shouldn't save too much, Michael. You never know. You might get hit by a bus tomorrow. Nah, not St. Michael here. My cousin, Roman, he has this gambling problem as well. Can't have a dollar in his pocket without spending it at the card game. Are these his dollars he's spending or yours? What's mine is his. We are cousins. Here we are, boys. Get Moment of here. fucking truth. I don't believe this. I can't believe it. Please proceed to highlighted route. All right, boys. If Ray is correct, then the money's going to be kept in the office in the main. Don't go too fucking far, Nico.
Cover me, will you? country in a boat, didn't you, Nico? That don't mean I can drive one. Fuck it, though. I'll give it a try. Fucking hell! That was fucking beautiful. We did ourselves proud. My brother Jerry's gonna be fucking ecstatic. Providing the Ancelotti's don't figure out it was us, they ripped them off. I don't fucking worry about it. So this figure was another one of the five families. Us McCreary's are under the fucking radar nowadays. It ain't a problem. I hope you're right. For my sake, to shut up and think about the money. If that don't work, think about my sister. I'll tell you, though, you're only getting your hands on one of those things, you maniac. And it ain't gonna be my Katie. I'll think about the money, then. What a trooper. I'll see you soon, Becky.
Chico man, look, I ain't a pepper nut. What are you talking about, man? I'm saying, would you take my sister Katie out for a drink or something? She don't get out much. She sure as hell don't go on stage. We're starting to work. She likes you. Just as friends. I'm gonna send you a note. I'll give her a call, man, but uh, I don't think she'll want to see me. Trust me, she will. Call her, man. Are you trying to get us both killed, you fucking asshole? What? I send you to... Where can I take you? I want to go to Dillon Street, yeah? Good as gold. Don't fuck about, let's go. Understood. My dad, he wanted me to be a physicist.
yards. Turn. the place. Okay, the mopes hold up in his apartment. It's on the fourth floor on the east side of the street. Go up onto the roof of the building opposite to get a shot at him. What if he isn't standing by the window? Then use your damn imagination to get him to the window. Jesus! I dealt with him. You did the right thing. I hope that the kids out there get this message and realize that there are better paths to take. I'm not interested in your sermon, Mr. McCreary. Let's not pretend that this was anything other than business. There's nothing wrong with admitting that you've done some good. The community thanks you. One percent better. If a hundred people manage that, it'd be a hundred percent.
get hurt! Come in. You're late, and please calm down out there. Excuse me? I didn't give you a free pass to act like an asshole. You're bringing a lot of heat. Hang out with bad people doing bad...
How could she do it with my best friend? Chopper taking off from Civilization Plaza. We need to get hold of it. Follow it. Wait until it touches down. Then, when the passengers are out, get in and fly to the airport in Dukes. Okay, then.
I think we are one heavy at this meet. He is mine! Get away from that! Okay, dude! Take it from here. My men have the chopper. They're going to strip it down and put it back together. It should be ready for you when you need it. Why would I need it? The guy I told you about. The guy you need to eliminate. The only way you'll get to him is in the air. I'll call you when we have a window. Goodbye.
Nothing to say to you. I nearly ran into your cousin the other day. My friends were uh, hanging out with him. The party got busted up though before I got there. I wish you had been there. We could have had some fun. Not as much fun as I would have had with Roman, believe me. Please make a U-turn where safe. Get a move on! I'm an old. In 10 yards, turn right. In 400 yards, turn right. Patrick McCreary, I probably don't remember giving you my number or who you are. Ladies, uh, I'm sorry it was a one night stand. Hey, Roman. Hello, Nico. How's it going? Killed anyone recently? Now that you mention it. Shit, Andy. I was choking. Who was it this time? This drug dealer, Playboy X. He tried to get me to get rid of a friend of his for him, but uh, I like the friend better. Nico, shit. I hope this guy is paying you good for saving his ass. He just got out of prison, and he hasn't got much, but I made the right decision. Ah, ah. Good, Andy. I'll talk to you later on. 